Sirenta for me is one of those games that I just keep coming back simply because the game is so be beloved by the developers that it kind of like doesn't matter uh, like what people could say about this game. This is just like one of the best games on Quest, like hands down, just because uh, the amount of work that uh, developers put into it is just like crazy, you know? Uh, I think like it was a while uh, when I did my last video on Sirenta. Uh, I think it was a mul multiplayer uh, video though. And today we will be checking out the... I guess we will be catching up kinda because like a lot of things changed uh, and we've been added. I'm most interested in the nightmare mode that I saw. It's basically that uh, seems that enemies and stuff like that are uniquely have their skills or whatever. Uh, so that's gonna be interesting. Let me just check like what's my load that I I have the pistol I know. I have my SMGs. I don't use a bow anymore. Uh, and I have my trusty shotgun. Okay. I have pretty much all add-ons is just because they cost nothing and they add like some cool features. Uh, I also surpassed the max level and I have like the additional skill points that uh, are marked on like all yellow orangish. Uh, what's my loadout? Yeah, fact one of HP. Pretty much I, you know, I kind of like played a lot in between. What's that? Endless cave. Uh, I think infinito mode was before. Yeah, yeah, it was uh, daily challenges, sure, whatever. Uh, tutorial, yeah, there's a codex which there wasn't there. It seems like it's like a compendium of enemies that you can uh, meet. This fucker. <laughs> uh, is it all of them? Yeah, it's all of them. Geisha, Kunichi, yeah, okay. Uh, wonder if someone's playing on the multiplayer. Let's see. Uh, only one person seems like it. Okay, so for now we'll uh, check out the Nightmare mode and we'll do that in... Uh, I guess let's do Wave Assault. Uh, all map modifiers, why not? It's more enemies, this damage from air attack, Kunoichi, a light, and this two waves of enemies, yeah. This is play life recovery. Uh, yeah, I'm fine with that. We'll do Nightmare, a light, max tier. Yeah, that seems fair for me. I I did not play a few weeks, so I might be rusty at the beginning. So let me just like warm up. And <laughs> I'm not even sure what's the nightmare mode about, kind of. I read some things, but not all of it. So it might be interesting, you know. So what's that? Okay. Okay. People are going on one shot, but like that's just that because I have a really uh, huge mod. This like really at high level, so it it's no surprise to me that everything goes on one. Uh, whoa! What's that? He has a shield now. So it's not like the game is easy, it's just that I played it so much that uh, I pretty much have to play on the max difficulty. And I feel like it's still a little bit too easy because I farmed a lot of things. So for my level that I have, it's still not enough, like... Like I need to earn... Pretty much I farmed modules, but not XP. So I'm under leveled. And I kill everything, pretty much. Shit. Yeah. Seems too OP. Let me see the... Shot, 
You see, like, there's a lot of mods. <laughs> So far I only saw one change, it's the sniper that has a shield, what about the others though? That big from behind. Jesus Christ. <laughs> For me it's so easy to do kill streaks just because I kinda I'll show later my loadout, but my loadout basically is all about consecutive kills, so uh, the more enemies I kill, the faster and more damage I do. So it's kind of like I need to actively kill in order to do some proper damage. So it's kind of like I can't sit around in one place. I need to constantly... It's kinda like I have to have a good kill count, kill streak or whatever. Jesus Christ, I'm wobbling on my bed <laughs> because I was too lazy to fold it. Jesus. But so far I just noticed one change. Let me drop the that and let's go with a pistol, I don't know. Like every weapon I have is OP except the bow. <laughs> the bow was fine in the beginning but now it's all about the bullets. Okay, well. The pistol is mainly all about headshots for me. And when I have no ammo. At least that's what I do. They do with the loadout. So it's like it's mostly headshot crit build. Oh this one is this one might have something new. Shit. I can't penetrate that. Oh wow. He has a perfect guard. I oh, got them. Wait a minute. <laughs> Let me get the shotgun. Let me change. Shit. Let's do three shots. Damn. Unpenetrable. Damn it. <laughs> How did I do that? Ah, uh, like that, okay. I feel like I have to do that from behind, yeah. God damn it. Yeah, the shotgun won't be good here. Damn it. <laughs> Okay, yeah, something like that. Ah! Okay. It seems like the only the elites have some special skills, like the yellow ones. I thought like Geisha would have and this ninjas also. But maybe not, I don't know. Or maybe I didn't know this at all. <laughs> I 
feel like it's gonna be the end. I know because I I have a module map modifier with two additional waves. Whoops. Damn, even though it's on a light and max tier, I don't really act like suffer high damage, <laughs> but I have nearly 2000 2, HP, so that's a little bit different though. <laughs> Oh shit, empty. <laughs> okay. From behind. Okay, now two extra waves. Then sniper. <laughs> I snipe also, but with a different weapon. Good then. I saw you. <laughs> My feet hurt because I need to balance. God damn it. What's that? Oh no, okay. God damn it, you. No, don't run from me. <laughs> I'm literally tanking everything and they still can't kill me. Perfect guard is annoying a little bit, but not undefeatable. But he stands in a bad position for me. Right now. Okay. So that's two. What's more? And mind you, this update was uh, free. <laughs> so. <laughs> This is kind of like a testimony that people really care about this game. <laughs> it's kind of like it, de it deserves all the praise for an action arcade game. Hey, where are you going? <laughs> Whoa! What was that? Jesus! <laughs> ah, ammo! Okay. Whoa! It's him! No, no, no. Ah, low HP. For once. Here. Whoa. Do they have a poison or something? Got them. Oh, 
feel like the geisha do is doing something. Are these homing? Now? Ah, damn you. Oh! Okay, well. <laughs> yeah, they are homing. They weren't before. They are like... Dodging the obstacles. Where is this bitch? Here. <laughs> okay. That's interesting change. I'm a little bit sweating. Then, where is she? Here. Okay, I feel like it's the last wave, so let me just kill everyone. No playing around. <laughs> A lot of enemies, really. <laughs> Just spawn. Okay. Condemn me. So if Geisha has upgraded uh, attack, what does this mini ninjas do? Do. Well, I mean, she's dying too fast, so... Okay, clear things... Okay. Oh, my feet! <laughs> Maybe next time I should actually fold my bed. <laughs> uh, that's a lot of XP for the normal uh, stage. How many levels is this? Okay, oh, like six. Oh yeah, there's also weapon XP, so with using the weapons on the stage you also get XP and additional upgrades to them. I'm not gonna even read that because that's too much. <laughs> uh, okay, so that's... I think that's for this DLC. What's new? Um, like I heard in multiplayer, you actually have different modes, right? But ah, let me show you the, my loadout. So basically, uh, no, this one is shit. Uh, on shotgun, uh, nothing really exciting. It's just that this is the shotgun from one DLC, and all I have is flat damage with faster rate of fire and that's pretty much <laughs> the whole point of it. SMGs are pretty unique so I have a dual view mastery because I always have them two at the same time and sustain fire. This one pretty much does what I said that and uh, the more bullets I shoot now the more uh, okay the more bullets I hit within one second I mean, you <laughs> you see the premise. B basically, I hit the bullets and I shoot faster. Faster? No, just more damage. Okay. So what's the... Ah, oh, no, it's a different SMG. It's the... What's his face? Uh, Slaggers had the... Uh, like, varied attack speed. This one is just that uh, my damage uh, increases while I will hit the bullets. So yeah, that's pretty much it. And I like a pistol is just a pistol, flat uh, damage also. So it's not really like hard to understand. It's just that 
some units like especially for SMG unit uh concrete uh, more uh, like what's this uh, called even <laughs> uh relics okay uh armor i think pretty much the most um, importantly is this because i have percentages high percentages uh, added to that that's why i have such a high amount uh and i wanna see um on multiplayer because i think i can quickly set up so intel invested what's that oh, okay i can invest intel for more loot that's great because intel usually is i think for yeah buying stuff on shop which not many people do unless you really wanna uh some concrete relics to obtain to buy so what do we have uh, okay many oh suburb slums that's two new maps that i didn't see and are actually new modes okay so elimination survival time attack wave social gun sensation endurance okay so that's uh, pretty much everything that we have currently on in the missions and in multiplayer also which which is great uh, let me just see quickly how the, those two maps look and uh, yeah ju just just to see whatever oh jesus well oh, that seems pretty big okay wait let me climb shit i need two bounce Damn, that's a little bit high. <laughs> okay. Okay, so... I don't want to kill stuff. So you have high rooftops with... That's huge! The map is huge! Damn! It's like ideal also for multiplayer. I feel like... Flying cars... Some... Uh, Fats! <laughs> <laughs> uh, some I don't know. Yeah, that's pretty fun, pretty nice. I feel like you. This is the end of the map, yeah. Or can you go a tree further? No. Okay, that's fine. So let me see the the other map. I feel like that's like the biggest map that I actually saw in Sirenta. And let me see the slums. I feel like that that's from the new stuff that I didn't see. I, I feel like I will skip anyway something, unfortunately, but okay. Uh, uh, this one is just a little bit smaller, I feel like, but also really cool, seems like. Yeah, because you have like different crevices. It seems like a futuristic Japanese dystopia or something. <laughs> ah, okay. Terminal. Some trash. Okay. Right, let me just uh, quickly see in the patch notes if uh, there's something I missed. I feel like there are also grenades, which I didn't see. Oh yeah, let me see the loadout. Maybe there's something new here. Okay, so these are new weapons. Famous weapon, the infrared missile launcher. What the hell is this? Is this... These are missiles, like RPG. But why is the sound? A little bit weird, like, it's not a huge explosion, it's just like... Plum! Plum! <laughs> okay. What's this damage? Uh, yeah, that's a lot. <laughs> Nobunaga, that's grenade launcher, I think, right? Aha, uh -huh. this can like... Okay. Uh, Kunai, there was... Kirigiri, yeah, yeah, yeah. 
shotguns, nothing new, disintegrator are so already. Uh, yeah, figment. I didn't see that. Apparently, it's an SMG that here. It's able to create holograms upon a critical hit. Uh, hit. So it seems like. Oh, maybe I will actually run with that. Oh, they are so small. <laughs> so it seems like when you get a critical hit, which usually is done by headshots, or if you have a relic that has uh, a critical hit chance. We have 25 in the magazine, so that's, that's fair. I wonder what would be better. I think Figments would be way better than Tempest, because then I can just instantly have uh, this relic active and like with dual building stuff like that hell i mean that's i think it would be really cool because the base is uh yeah that's pretty good stats 10 21 i feel like it has bigger pull size right uh, yeah a little bit high crit damage though like 220 is crazy that's pretty much double of Tempest with no relics at all. <laughs> wow. So it's purely made for headshots, I feel like. <laughs> it's kind of like, I feel like to get the max DPS from all the SMGs, this one is purely for headshots. Great, I mean, maybe I'll try that uh, uh, later. Let me see the patch notes. Uh, okay, so DLC map, map, Nightmare Mort, Codex, use of Intel, yeah, mod by the fires, level cap of weapons. Uh, what's in my Nightmare? Improved responses time, yeah, slightly faster, projector suite, Ashigaru, yeah, bushy block bullets, yeah, blade work will pass through environment, yeah, okay. Geisha explodes upon death. So, but I thought she had, she had not the homing fans. Okay. Uh, yeah, I feel like that's kind of like from that. Yeah, pretty much uh, that's it uh, for now. This is a fuck ton of money. <laughs> uh, I, I, I don't think I will get ever bored uh, by by this game. And it's just only gonna get better, so <laughs> I wish uh, more people would play, but like I feel like this game has one of the best multiplayers anyways, so if people really want to play with someone like with friends or whatever, this is basically the game to do it um yeah, <laughs> entertaining as fuck, <laughs> uh yeah, <laughs> that's it pretty much. <laughs>